I love it. I freaking love it. <laughs> it's giving me Prince vibes. When doves cry. <laughs> Metro haul. I don't have a whole lot of pieces, but I just wanted to um, pretty much show you what I got over the Christmas break. Um, I got some much needed items. My mom was here visiting this holiday break and she encouraged me to get some pieces and she helped me find some things that I could wear because I'm on a weight loss journey and I didn't want to get a whole bunch of stuff um, because I plan on losing some weight and I don't want to have to buy a whole bunch of new clothes um, all over again. Yes, I got rid of a lot of clothes um, and I gave a lot of clothes away. I gave some clothes to my mom. Um, so now I have only the things that I wear. I do have two bins that of things that are summer clothes and things that are strictly summer summer clothing um, and then I have a bin of things that I want to get back into and I just they fit a little too snug and I know some people don't really do that anymore maybe they don't I don't know I know I do that so <laughs> I have some things that I want to kind of work my way back into so that's why you see me in these workout pants these pants are actually from Pop Fit. I did a review on these a long time ago and I have two pair of these. I have this pair and I have another pair that has um, some mesh on the sides. This, this pair has mesh in the front, but they fit really, really good. They're easy to work out in. They don't come down on me while I'm working out. These are some really good workout pants. Blah, 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 blah. Let's get right into this haul, okay? I'm going to start with this top that I have on. It's like a long, it's a long sleeve ribbed crop top. And it is actually really, really comfortable. It's really, really comfortable. Normally I wouldn't buy anything like this for myself because they don't normally fit like I need it to. But this crop top is really, really cute. But yeah, I like this crop top because it's thick. It's um, ribbed, the sleeves are really nice and long. They come past my wrist and I really like that. And it's nice and ribbed, like these buttons actually open up. So if you wanna show some cleavage, you know, if you wanna button it back up, you know, be in a little more sexier side, whatever you wanna do, you know, I like it. I like it both ways. I thought this was really sexy and just a really nice piece to have. And my closet because I don't have anything like this and like with some high-waisted pants like this or jeans cute jeans or a skirt you know maybe cover up some more the stomach area just have a peep you know whatever this would be really cute now when you lift your arms you do see some of your some of the bra area but not that bad I really like this my I, I definitely might wear this out tonight. So this is the back of it. Going on date night tonight. And I really like, I really like this. So I have a skirt that I might wear with it. It's a really high skirt. So I don't know yet. I don't know how I'm gonna style this, but um, we will see. But this is the first piece from It's Fashions. Okay, so this next top is like really, really nice. It's soft, it's warm, and I love all of the detailing on it, all of the cut up details in the front of it. Those are really nice, and it has cut, de cut out details right here by the armpit areas. At first I was like, 
why is it cut up right there but i kind of like that i kind of like it now it flows it fits really loose in the back and on the sides and the sleeves are really nice and long yeah but i love this sweater it fits really really well this is like one of my favorite sweaters now it's gonna be one of my favorite sweaters this is that one you guys and this is the back of it back this is front so yeah i love it and for some reason this sweater makes me want to keep my locks swung over to the side like this i don't know why it just feels like this is the look i feel like the sweater needs but yeah that's this sweater you guys okay so here is the next piece this is also a three size 3x um the sleeves are a little tucked right here at the wrist, and then they kind of get really baggy. I forget what kind of sleeves you call that, but they get extra baggy on the arms, which I really, really love. And then it has a drawstring right here. So I could probably make this into, I probably could make it into a crop type of, not really a sweater, but it's like that sweater material. It's like that sweats, sweatshirt material. It's really, really soft. And I probably could tuck it under, could probably bring it up to make it kind of crop a little bit, like a baggy crop. Or I could just bring it back down to my waist area. Um, it's really, really soft. It has like a little bit of ribbing on it. And it's like an olive green color. And I just love the sleeve. Look, look at the sleeve. I love that. I love oversized baggy sleeves. In the winter time, these are just really, really nice. It's a really lightweight shirt. It's not really heavy sweater. I actually thought that um, I had other two sweaters in this haul, but it's actually my Walmart haul. So I'll get to that in the next video. But this shirt is everything. I love it. This is a size 3X. And I got a lot of these pieces on sale and then some I got at regular price. So I'll try to put the prices down below. Also, for you, if you guys have It's Fashions or It's Fashions Metro in your area, try to look on the sale racks because they have a lot of great sale items, sale pieces. Um, here's the back of it. Here's the side. Here's the front. Fix my bra because I don't have it. Muffin top with boobies. <laughs> okay, there we go. So that's this shirt. So this shirt, this blouse is giving me medieval, I don't know, uh Bridgerton type vibes right now. That's what this that's what this is giving me. Like look at look at the shoulders, look at the ruching on the shoulders right here. And just look at this. It's giving me like it prints vibes. Like it's everything. It's giving me like fake corset vibes right here. This is not a corset. So it's just short. It's a short shirt. It stops right here at my mid torso. And I love it. I freaking love it. <laughs> it's giving me prints vibes. When doves cry. <laughs> That's what this is giving me. So, I just love it. And, you know, if you want to kind of, if you want to pin it right here, you could to kind of cover up the bra showing piece right there. You know, you are probably going to show some cleavage because of the V neck and how low it is which I'm fine with that. I'm fine with this right here. I like this. Put some nice necklaces on or a nice statement earring on. And this is giving me purple rain print vibes. Look at this. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> yes. Purple rain, purple rain. This is giving me Prince vibes and I love it. Look at the dramatic sleeve. 
oops, got some string he's gonna cut those off, but look at that. I told y'all I love a dramatic sleeve. This would be really cute with some nice, like, color blocking, like some nice, or some wild color pants or something like that, or like a print color pant. This would be really nice. It'll be nice with um, leopard print. Leopard print will really be nice with this. Um, like some leopard print pants. I had some leopard print pants a while ago, and I love those pants. <laughs> I had those pants when I was um, teaching in South Korea, and I can't wear those. Those pants are long gone. I, can, I couldn't fit those pants now. Okay. <laughs> okay. Here's the front. Here's the next item. It's this olive green dress. And it's kind of like a, um, what do you call it? Pencil skirt dress, or I can't think of the word right now. But a tunic dress. Not really tunic. Tunics come up all the way to your neck. But. This dress is very much like um, like a cotton type feel and it's ribbed a little bit all the way down and it has like these faux drawstrings at the bottom. It's kind of ruching right here, but they're not really drawstrings. It just has that appearance of drawstrings and you can tie them up right here. And I wore black tights and black shoes, heels with this and my tights kind of sucked me in just a little bit. And I just wore this and I had on my earrings that I made, my handmade earrings. And it really brought the outfit out. My mom had on like, um, like this really cute green, red, and black, and um, like burnt orange um, outfit. And we had on a uh, black, black outfit. And so we coordinated like that. And I thought the pictures were really nice. And I will insert a picture here so you can see our, our picture that we took. And this is what we coordinated for our Christmas pictures this year. We want to keep it simple and to the point. <laughs> but this dress could be worn with like some sneakers or some boots. Um, or you can dress it up again with like a nice peak toe heel. Um, it could be really nice. It's such a thin material. Well, it's not a thin, thin material, but it's thin enough to wear in the summertime. Um, and then you just kind of layer it in the winter time. Um, but you definitely can transition this to the spring or summer time. But it comes about mid thigh, well a little bit right above the knee. It's not that short. And this is the back side of it. This is the back. Make sure you wear some type of you know, like a, um, so maybe a boy short, so you won't see your panty line, um, or a thong, or no panties at all, if that's what you like. <laughs> and, um, maybe just wear some tights or something, and, yeah. And then you can style it up with, like, maybe some fur. That'd be cute. This is, like, a blank canvas dress, and I love those types of dresses because you can add all types of accessories and things with them. But yeah, that's this one. Okay, next we have, next we have these bell-bottom, black bell-bottom pants. Um, these are size 3X and y'all, oh, I love these pants. You know why? Because they come all the way up here, y'all. They have so much stretch in these pants lots of stretch lots of stretch in these pants these are so so cute and they feel so comfortable oh my gosh these are so cute y'all and they feel amazing they feel so good these are a size 3x some of my other pants have number sizes but these are a size 3X. So I would guess it's maybe a 22, 24. That's what these are. These are so cute. And the bell bottoms are really long. They're not high watery and they come up on me. So like I love high waisted pants and I love pants that um, go all the way to my ankle. Or if they're bell bottoms like these, they go past my, my, my ankle. 
And these would be nice with a cute heel, like a cute wedge heel. You know, these would be really, really cute with some nice, cute leopard flats. If you don't mind them dragging on the floor, which I love for my skirts and pants and whatever to drag on the floor and my pants and everything. I love that look. Um, but yeah, y'all, these feel so, so good. So right now I think I'm a size 22-24 in pants and jeans. And so if I had to guess, this 3X is probably around that. But they're extra, extra stretchy. So that actually, that actually really helps me get them on and keep them on. So look at that squat test. Ooh, ooh, the knees though, the knees. <laughs> but these are good. Okay, I'm buttoning these up. All right. I haven't even taken the tags off of these. Um, okay. So these are fit and flatter all shapes. Get high rise flare jeans. That's what these are. Um, these are called flare jeans. They're high rise again. These actually, these are not full buttons. These are real buttons with real button loops and it buttons up. So, I hope they don't pop. <laughs> but these jeans are bell bottom pants as well. And they have like this little nice stiffness in the bell bottom area, which I love. They're really, really comfortable. Again, these come up nice and high, all the way up over the bottom. Um, the high rise in the stomach area right here too. They come up full coverage. They have like a long seam down the bottom on each side. And these pants feel really sturdy. Um, like they don't feel like they're cheap, thin jeans actually. Um, I think these are right for price. I don't know. But these are really, really comfortable. The pocket is kind of short. So like my hands literally stop right here. They have real pockets in the back as well. The black pants I just had on, the pockets in the front were not real, but they did have real back pockets. Um, so these are really, really cute and comfortable. And again, I love these too. This flare on these aren't as flared out as the black pair, but I like that. And they have like a little ruffle raggedness at the bottom of them. And I really like that. So these are really, really cute, you guys, as well. Um, here's the back. They come out really, really well. Here's the front. And I love these. Like, I love how these fit. These fit just as comfortable as the black pair of Tagal. And these are the only two pair that are wide um, bell-bottom pants at the bottom. So these are really, really cute. I love it. I love it. I love it. So that's these. Hey. So now try on two more pair and then we're done. Alright. So these pants are straight leg pants. They're like, they're kind of like a dragging, but they feel more jean than jagging. And they're just a really stretchy jean, like the black pair. But these have like kind of a buckle right here going on and but they're dark wash and I love them they have fake pockets in the front and two pockets in the back but they are straight leg pants and they're kind of like an unfinished at the ankle which are I'm okay with these would be really good with boots um, or flats or heels these, these pants would look really nice with some heels um, I don't like the fact that I make, there's a buckling in the back, like there's some uh, space right there, but they do come up all the way. Um, but in 
they're not as high rise as the other ones. Um, I think these actually said mid rise. So yeah, these say mid rise, so that's why. But they still come up pretty high on me to where it's not showing a whole, whole lot. And I probably just have to wear a shirt to cover it up because I don't like wearing belts. Belts just, mm, I never like wearing belts like that. So, but um, that's these pants. I love how dark wash they are. They're like a dark, they're dark blue. And that's these pants. So, they kinda, they come up so you see that part right there. But other than that, they come up pretty good. For them to be mid-rise pants, I think these come up nice and high. And I have a lot of room to like squat down in them, you know, do the little squat seat test. But these work really, really well. All right, so here are the last pair of pants for this haul. And <laughs> these took a little bit of work, but I like these pants. They fit, they have pockets on the sides right here, kind of like cargo-like a little bit. And they have deep pockets on the side and it has a snap clamp there. I can get it. So that snaps closed on both pockets. They have a drawstring closure, no zipper or buttons or anything. And it's just elastic in the waist a little bit. And then they have this drawstring, which I can tighten up right here. And um, these are really good. The ankle, they have like a drawstring closure at the ankle, so you can tighten those up too. Um, they have real pockets in the front and real pockets in the back. These also come all the way up. I think these are considered mid-rise too, but they come all the way up on my butt right here. And these come all the way up here too, past my belly button as well, which I like. And they're not really snug or tight or pinching or anything there. And this would be good with, um, this actually is pretty cute with the crop top. Um, but this would be cute with, you know, a nice top. I love graphic tees, so any graphic tee that looks good with like a skirt or jean, that is what I like to wear when I'm dressed down. If I'm not going to work that day, like today, I'm on vacation. But these work really well. They're dark wash, as you can see. Here's the back of them. And here's that. So I like these. But this is my haul. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and share this haul if you're into plus size clothing and um, on a budget, then that is what my videos are about. I also will be doing videos on self care and even maybe, maybe some budgeting videos, maybe, I'm not sure yet. I would definitely probably be doing some um, business videos because I have a jewelry business as well. And I will be showcasing some of my jewelry maybe from time to time up here also. Um, so I will put all of my links down below for you to follow me on Locks and Curves Queen on IG. Follow me on at Fly Honey um, on, on Instagram and on Facebook for both of those as well. But I'll put all that down below. Thank you guys for watching um, me get through this haul. <laughs> it's been a long, long time since I did a clothing haul, but hopefully I can come back with a few more from time to time. Um, because I don't plan on doing too, too much shopping, uh, clothing shopping. But if I see something, I'll try to haul it and um, I'll try to show you guys what I got. So please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Until next time, peace and blessings.